Hey, what's up everybody? Doug here with Breakthrough Guitar. Now let's talk about how to make an easy guitar riff. So let's talk about a couple ways to make this spicy. First, we got palm muting. So let's make a power chord on the seventh fret of the A. So seven on the A, nine on the D, and nine on the G, and then play your open E. So we have a big E power chord. Make it heavier, place your palm on it and palm mute. And play around with how it sounds. All right, now we're gonna add chugga chugs. So we got chug, 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 chug. So we're gonna play that on beat two. One and two E and. So that's what it's gonna sound like. One and two E and three and four and then it starts all over again. So we're gonna add an accent on the and of four. So this is how you count it. We're gonna palm mute the whole time. One, and, two, e, and. So down, 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 up, down, 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 loud. Down, 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 up, down, 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 loud. Once you got that down, we're going to change chords now. Let's progress this chord progression. So this is just gonna be kind of like a metal chord progression. And I'm gonna show you how to make heavy, heavy sounding chords. So if you use an inverted chord, you can make it sound even heavier. So instead of playing root, fifth, root again, which most power chords are root, fifth, root, this is fifth, root, minor third. So this is an F sharp minor chord. So if you put your ring finger, ninth fret on the E, little finger, ninth fret on the A, and index finger, seventh fret on the D, you have an inverted F sharp minor chord. Just the chord, you know, the chord you would play down here. So this is the inversion of it. And the way you can figure that out is this note. Once you learn the notes on the A string, this is an F sharp. And then we're gonna slide it down to an F. So F sharp. And then we're gonna move down to the F. And then back to the E. All right, now let's play it all together. One, two, three, four. Okay, awesome, hope you had fun jamming along to me. This is a great start when it comes to writing metal riffs. Just palm muting, doing chugga chugs, just playing da da da, and you can do that on any count, one, two E and, or you could do a three E and, or you could do a four E and, you can mix and match it. You can even do it at the beginning, one E and, two and, three and, four and, one E and, two and, three and, and it changes the whole feel of it. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and so you can have fun with it. You can even throw it on the and a four. One and two and three and a four and so just mix and mix and match where you're gonna add that chug a chug while you're chugging and play around with accents. Just throwing a there's so much you can do with both of those techniques, combining it with palm muting. So if you enjoy guitar tips and tricks like this, especially for those beginners and intermediate players, please follow and we'll keep having more fun.